Anyone can now earn money using ChatGPT. Yes, you heard it right. OpenAI recently announced GPT Store, which will provide you a platform to earn money by creating custom chat GPTs. Anyone can do that. If you know how to use chat GPT, then you can utilize this opportunity to earn money using GPT Store. So in order to earn money using GPT Store, you need to create your custom GPTs, your own custom GPTs. You can do that by using GPT Builder. In this video, I will show you how you can build your custom GPTs using GPT Builder and how you can make money using those custom built GPTs. Before that, if you are a new visitor to a channel, please subscribe to the channel so that you will get regular updates on technologies, career related stuff and passive income tips. Also, please like this video so that this video will be suggested to similar audience like you. GPT Builder is a place where you can create your own custom GPTs. I will share my screen and I will show you how you can create your own custom chart GPT model. So if you open chart GPT, you will find a section called explore. In order to do that, you need to be a chart GPT plus user. It is uh, mandatory. So you need to, you need to have subscribed to chart GPT plus already so that you will find this explore section here. You will see, uh, these are all the GPTs that I have created so far. These are all custom GPTs created by me. Now you can see in the top, you will find an option called create a GPT. If you click that, you can create a custom chart GPT here. Let's suppose uh, I want to create a chart GPT, uh, which will write blog outlines if uh, given a situation. Uh, I'm here like I want to give an input about like my idea. So I need to provide what GPT that I wanted to create. I will write something like this. I want to create a GPT which will write blog outlines based on the topic name that I provide based on the topic name that is provided. So if anyone uh, gives a blog title or uh, a blog idea the GPT should provide a complete blog outline so it is my idea see I'm, I'm giving this input so this is the idea that I have so I wanted to create a GPT which will write blog outlines based on whatever the topic or whatever the input that I'm provided let's see how GPT will respond GPT builder will respond creating a new GPT in the backend the idea is successfully created and it's suggesting me a title like how about we name this GPT blog outline genius I'm saying yes I'm okay with that because I, li I like the title as well now it will create uh, a, a profile picture uh, for my own GPT because it it's going to have uh, a custom profile picture and again GPT will do that for us GPT builder will do that for us we don't need to create using a Canva or Photoshop GPT builder will itself create a profile picture for us unique profile picture I think yeah this this sounds this looks awesome so I think um, I'm fine with it so profile picture is ready blog title is ready if you can see in the right side it's uh, I mean you can see the outline blog outline genie is the title and a blog outline get for various topics post and creativity and structure everything is fine and it's asking me like what should be the tone of my uh, GPT which um, I'm going to create I'd say like uh, casual and it should ask for more details I mean whenever I give an input it should ask me more details about uh, the blog topic or the idea that I have so that it can provide me a detailed outline or good outline I can say because if I just give a random name and it provide me a random outline that won't serve my purpose so it should provide enough context so that that is very important and it is updating the GPT based on my input. Now let's move on to the next aspect when thinking about the guidelines emphasis or avoid it technical jargon for us focusing on ensuring the outlines are SEO friendly uh, it's, it's asking me like what kind of things that it should avoid or what kind of things that you should keep in mind I'm saying that it should be SEO friendly friendly yeah. 
I'm giving my input like I wanted the outline should be SEO friendly so that it can rank in uh, Google searches or whatever the search engine is. Now it's it's asking me would it would you prefer it to ask for clarification when something is not clear so yeah it will ask us more questions so that our GPT would be more accurate so uh, I'm just giving the same input again yes it should see clarification if the input is not clear so I'm just saying it like yeah it should see clarification if the input is not clear because then only uh, my GPT can provide more detailed outline or more accurate outline not just a random outline so then my I want my GPT to be perfect so I'm uh, giving this lastly let's personalize blogger now how would you like it to speak to you should it use modern slang be humorous or maintain a more neutral and professional tone uh, I can say more casual and neutral tone would be ideal so I'm giving this like my GPT would sound more casual and neutral and like complete professional way you can actually uh, test here as well so let's suppose in the right side I'm asking write an outline for top AI advancements in the decade so I'm testing my GPT here I'm asking write an outline for top AI advancements in the decade let's see how my GPT will respond to it so yeah it, it uh, provided me an outline my outline is ready so it is how you can uh, use chart GPT builder or GPT builder to create your own custom GPTs so once your GPT is ready in the top right you need to make it published to everyone so that it will be live so when our GPT store is live all the GPTs that were created will be live in the store and you can set a price whoever likes to use your GPT they will pay you the money so it is how you can make money using chart GPTs a new future GPT store please share it with someone whom you think will get benefit from this thank you for watching